Unity thing, yes! Woo! <laughs> All right, welcome to Open Source Bridge. <laughs> so, uh, just to give you an idea, there are more than 400 of you here today. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's really, really cool, and we're very happy that you're here. Um, so we created this conference for open source citizens. Um, we want people to actively participate and uh, contribute to this conference. Um, and you know, you're here, you're here to do that, to collaborate with each other on, about free and open source software. So welcome. Um, one thing that I wanted to do before I get too far was acknowledge our sponsors. We really couldn't have done this conference without them. And there were quite a few, as you can see. Yes. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> um, and specifically, I wanted to point out, point out a few. Um, first up, and actually Tom's here in the front row, and he's going to make a little announcement, but um, Yahoo Developer Network uh, sponsored at the committer level, um, and they specifically sponsored the Hacker Lounge, which is over at the Hilton on the top floor. It's pretty cool. Um, and there's going to be, over the next three days, uh, hacking sessions that people have scheduled. You can check them out on the wiki. Um, and Yahoo Developer Network, I know that Stacy is here, I know that Rasmus um, is here. Uh, they, they brought several people, so you should, you should say hi and thank you if you see them. But uh, Tom, if you wanted to just come up real quick and make the announcement. Hello everybody. Um, so obviously I'm not American, um, but I, I do really rather like your fair country. Um, so we've partnered with uh, the Sunlight Foundation who help people uh, create open e-government um, and help promote democracy. Um, and we're releasing some tools today, they're going to be available on our blog um, to help you do that. But also Sunlight are running um, a hackathon um, all this week um, in the Hacker Lounge in the Hilton. But there's an introduction today at 3 o'clock and we'd really like to see as many people from the open source community start participating in e-government and kind of giving something back to your democracy. So, um, viva la revolution. <laughs> Thank you, Tom. So yeah, Hacker Lounge over in the Hilton. Um, we had a few other sponsors. They were um, in-kind sponsors. One was Network Redux. They did our awesome hosting. Thank you very much, Thomas. I, don't, I haven't seen him yet today, but... Um, yeah, they, they hosted all of our website and everything. That was great. Um, we also had uh, Travel Command. They uh, helped us with the Hilton, and they offered um, travel services for free to anybody at the conference. I hope that somebody took advantage of that. Um, and we also have CubeSpace. Um, I know that a lot of you here know about CubeSpace. Yeah. <clears throat> and we're... We're sad that they closed last week, but um, over the last six months, they played host to Open Source Bridge meetings, and um, they hosted two town halls for us, um, and they've really been um, the center of, of tech community here in Portland, hosting meetings, um, uh, bar camp, um, several other on conferences. They're just really great, and we're sad to see them go. So thank you, Eva and David. So um, before I turn it over to Amber and then Kurt, I wanted to take a minute to talk to you about you. Um, these are some pictures of our speakers that, that we collected. Um, and if you look around this room right now, um, one in four of you are actually presenting at this conference this week. So, <laughs> so you're rubbing elbows with the speaker right now. Um, we have, among our many distinguished guests, we have Ward Cunningham, who is the inventor of the wiki. Just so happy to have him here. Um, <laughs> you don't have to clap every time, but thank you. Um, and uh, we have, <laughs> I know, I, I asked for that. Um, we, uh, we have uh, the author of the first USB 3 driver, which is for Linux, it's an open source driver. Um, that's Sarah Sharp. She was just featured on Engadget last week, which was just so exciting. Um, we have uh, Rasmus, who I mentioned earlier, who, Rasmus Lerdorf, who um, was the founder of the PHP project. Um, we have uh, Deb Bryant, who um, is from the OSU Open Source Lab, um, which hosts many projects, and uh, they run GauzCon, the Government and Open Source Conference, just a really neat organization that's uh, here, here in Oregon. 
Uh, anyway, we, we have lawyers, <laughs> we have managers, we have sysadmins, teachers, business people, just a whole lot of different folks who all work with, with open source. And we have one Australian. <laughs> and I just wanted to, some of you know about this, we have our first non-human participant in the conference, OS Bridgebot. Um, I wanted to also point out that um, one in three of our speakers this week are female, and that happened. <laughs> Um, that happened because we, we talked to all of our friends and we, we asked them um, specifically to submit proposals. Um, and yeah, and it just turned out really well, which is great. 17% of you are vegetarian. <laughs> Hopping. Um, and another question that we asked um, everyone when you were filling out your registration was, how many, how, how many years have you been involved in open source? 92% of you said more than one year. 81% uh, of you said more than three years. 43% said more than seven years, which I was, I was really amazed at this actually, which is pretty cool. Um, and then we had this like more than 11 years <laughs> mark out there, but 18% of you, which turned out to be I think about 36 people here um, have been involved in open source for more than 11 years, which is pretty cool. So then I did some calculations and uh, I figured out that that was probably about 1,400 years of open source experience in this room. So uh, please take advantage of that. <laughs> um, so now that you know a little bit more about who you're here with, you know, what, what can you do while, it, while you're here? Well, what we really want out of this conference is for you all to be able to talk to each other. Um, everyone here is here to share an experience to learn from one another and hopefully hatch some new, new plans, new projects. We really wanna see that happen. Um, and I, I mentioned collaboration a little bit earlier. Um, and there's this guy, uh, David Eames, who describes collaboration as jointly solving problems. Um, and he said that the ability to collaborate is the thing that open source does best, open source community does best. Uh, and I, I totally agree with that. I think that this is something that we can export to the rest of the world, that we can teach other people how to do, um, which is how we manage to take these insanely complex problems and, and write code together to, to solve them. So that, that's what we're hoping to get out of this. Um, by the way, I don't think I said my name in the beginning. My name's Selena Deckelman, and I'm co-chair of this conference. And right over here, <laughs> we have Audrey Eshright, who, who also is here. Uh, Co-chair. Um, so, oops, I wonder what I'm doing now. This is all messed up. Here, here. You're talking to yourself. I am talking to myself. It does. It does say hi, neighbor, but it's not coming up. Fail. Oh, there we go. Ha ha. Win. Okay. So. Um, you guys were all talking to each other earlier, which was so great. It was so amazing, just the energy. I was sitting up here with Amber, and we were just talking about, wow, energy in this room is so great. Like, people seem so excited. And I, I want you to all just take a minute right now to turn to your neighbor, one of your neighbors. you got to pick a side now. This is the hardest part of this, hardest part of this exercise. And um, I, want you, I want you to share a problem, share a problem that you want to solve. So just, just take a minute and look at the person there and tell them about a problem that you have.
Okay, so I'm gonna have to break in on everybody's great work that they're already doing. You solved all the problems, right? It's all done now. Yeah, we can go home. We solved them all. <laughs> you guys are great. Well, I hope, I hope at least you started a conversation that you can finish, finish in a little bit, because yeah, I, the whole point of this for us is for us to meet people, for you to meet people, um, yeah, for us, for us to become a, a tighter community. So um, I just had a couple announcements. Um, speaking of sharing, um, we've hooked up the conferenceware application to the wiki. So if you go to any particular session, there's a link now, and if you click on it, it will take you to a wiki page that you can create. So if you're taking notes during any of the sessions, please like upload them to the wiki. Um, the wiki is there for you to edit. Uh, so just add, add whatever, whatever content you want there. Um, and one other note is we are actually live streaming this uh, room um, for the next two days. So uh, if you just go to the front page of the site, you'll see that. So if you know there's some people that weren't able to make it, um, if you have friends at home that, that wanted to come, just send them, send them to the front page and they can pick up the stream. So that's all I had. So um, now I'm gonna turn it over to Amber and uh, I'm gonna let her get her laptop set up and then I'll introduce her real quick. So thank you everybody.